Hey, I'm Dustin. If there's one video you watch and share about the eclipse, make it this one. Top 10 things you need to know about eclipse day in just a couple of minutes. Number one, know where you're going to watch the eclipse from. There's this thing called the totality plane. If you're inside of it, you see a total eclipse. If you're outside, you see a partial eclipse. Don't freak out about getting right on the midline. If you're a little bit away from that, it's okay. You're going to have a very good experience. Plan on traffic. Take extra food and extra water. Number two, know exactly when the eclipse is going to happen. Download this app. Solar Eclipse Timer. It's going to talk you through the eclipse. Android, Apple, click this button to locate where you are inside the totality plane. Click this button. You are now ready to listen to the events of the eclipse. Number three, know exactly what the times mean. C1 is when the moon first touches the sun, about an hour, hour and a half later. C2 is when the total eclipse starts. C3 is when the total eclipse ends. And C4 is the end of the eclipse. The moon leaves the sun. Number four, make sure you have your solar glasses. Know how to use them. The only time you can take them off is between C2 and C3 total eclipse. Make sure they are safe for direct solar viewing. Number five, if you're going to take pictures, you have to use a filter. You're going to want to take that filter off about 20 seconds before C2. You're also going to have to change your settings because the light is changing and you want to be able to take pictures of the corona. Have a plan. Number six, look for shadow bands. They're like shadow snakes on the ground just before and just after the eclipse. If you're going to video it, lay out a white sheet, know where north is. It's really interesting. Scientists don't know why they happen. Number seven, observe the environment around you. Temperature is going to drop. Crickets are going to chirp. Animals are going to do weird things. People are going to get really excited. Watch the stuff around you. Number eight, if you're a photographer, there's three things you want to get. The diamond ring, Bailey's beads, and the corona. I made a video on how to do that. Number nine, at max totality, get your face away from the gear and just take it all in. The 360 degree horizon is going to be colored it's going to be amazing. That's the moment where you just need to experience it. Interact with your family. I'm excited about that part. Number 10, tell other people. If they know exactly the cool science stuff to look for during the eclipse, it's going to be a way more awesome experience. So tell people. I've left a checklist at smartereveryday.com slash eclipse. Go get that. Use it on eclipse day. I hope you love it. I hope you have a great time. That's all the information I could cram into a very short video about the eclipse. Please consider sharing this with anybody that's going to go. Like, I know we think about sharing videos. Actually share this one because this will completely enhance people's experience. I'm Dustin. You're getting smarter every day. Have a good one. Please share the video. I'd appreciate it. Bye. I am practicing how to be sad because of clouds. So I'm ready for the eclipse. Oh, yeah, it's working.